Yo, what's going on Kicks Army? Today I have a sneaker drawing video which is actually going to be a color pencils challenge of the NMD Bapes. My man Xbox Gamer Productions have been asking me to do this drawing for a while and I know everybody was asking me to do the Air Jordan 8 confetti. The only reason why I didn't do that drawing is because it's really, it's really plain. Like it's just black on the upper and then it has a little bit of colors on the side so it's nothing too crazy. And since today is my last day of my winter break before I go back to school tomorrow, I wanted to do something thing with a little bit of variety. I wanted to do something a little different than what I normally do so that way I can finish off my winter break strong. Now I'm gonna tell you what, like the moment I placed down the colored pencil and I was going at the outsole, the first thing I thought was like, oh my god, this is gonna suck. These colored pencils that I'm using, they're uh, Prank colored pencils, that's P-R-A-N-G I think. Let me double check. Yeah, P-R-A-N-G, Prank. I got these a while ago from Walmart, I think. It was like either 10 or 20 bucks. It was really cheap. It was a pack of 50 color pencils, right? Man, like I didn't realize like how bad these color pencils were, but I wanted to use these as a perfect example to show you guys that you don't need anything expensive to get semi-decent results. The only regret I have about this drawing is that I wish I would have had a different color tan or a beige so that way the upper would have looked better. And you're gonna see as I go through this drawing that for the upper, I have a variety between a gold and like an orangish beige that I used to do that beige upper. And I wish I had, you know, a color that was a little bit lighter, but I guess it works. So if it looks a little orangey, just know that's why. Man, I hate color pencils. I don't think I've ever actually used color pencils. Like, of course I've used them before in school and stuff, but in terms of my own personal art, it was pretty much always markers. Like even back when I didn't have enough money to buy like a full pack of Sharpies, at the very least I had, you know, regular Sharpies, the black Sharpies and the ultra fine Sharpies. So if anything, most of my work was done in black and white. And then if I had to add a little bit of color, I would mess around with a little bit of colored pencil, but I never liked it. I always preferred markers over colored pencils. That's just something I always had a preference on. Now considering I was using pretty cheap colored pencils and for the record, if prank, if, if you guys over in the prank organization are watching this, uh, your color pencils are great. Feel free to send me color pencils all the time. Actually, no, prank. If you're watching this and you haven't already sent me color pencils, what are you waiting? That's a soft move. You gotta send me color pencils now, right? At least better ones. No, but for real, guys, like I said, this is like a pack of 50 color pencils that I had. So you do have a lot of color pencils that you can work with. And like I said, you I got it from Walmart. It only cost me like 10 or 20 bucks. It was really, really inexpensive. You can also get better quality color pencils like Prismacolors and stuff over at Michaels and Hobby Lobby. And let me actually speak on that too. I don't want anybody who's watching this video, who's listening to my voice, to ever dare go to Hobby Lobby or Michaels to buy something that is relatively expensive without a coupon. If you go on Retail Me Not or any other website that offers coupons, you can see that quite often Michaels and Hobby Lobby, like those major art craft stores, will have like a 40 to 50% coupon and they do this all the time. Like whenever you go to Michaels, usually whenever you make a purchase, they will give you like an extra receipt that has a 40% off coupon. So if you're ever going to these stores and you're looking to buy something that's kind of expensive, don't you dare pay full price because that stuff is way overpriced. Like that's how their markup is, that's how they make their money. So if you're ever gonna buy like a pack of markers or a pack of colored pencils, go in there, right, get a coupon, you'll be good. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, comment down below, let me know what sneaker you'd like to see me draw for tomorrow's video. And I will see you guys tomorrow, peace.